helicopter to uh, get him out of that, that area and went to um, the hospital and he ended up breaking his hip and he had to be in a walker for like a good solid few months I think he finally got out so he's back to uh, living normal All right. Whoa, holy shit. Damn, almost got me. Well, that was, um, and she doesn't even look. You suck. Well, see, you just gotta be invisible. She immediately parked, opened her door, took her leg out and then went on her phone but it's okay we know they can't see us oh there's a car coming I guess it's back to the sidewalk guys but we're not going fast we're gonna be cruising today and maybe I'll tell you a story can't think of one right now but I I feel like I need to be completely focused riding on this mosquito so I can barely talk. Oh, there is adrenaline. There's the same amount of adrenaline and adrenaline I get when riding the mosquito because oh hey you're a nice bird. Oh a nice blue shade. Whoop. Oh man, these are low. I had to really duck. <laughs> That dude was on his phone. No worries, bro. It's my fault. Ooh, I am sliding. See, at least that guy acknowledged me. Oh, there was a concrete rock in the middle. If I would have hit that, it might have it might have made me slide. There's a branch coming up. I kind of want to run over it. Just to see what it does. No thank you, actually. I am not that curious. Uh, let's get back on the street over here. You know what? Oh, I really do not like being on the street right now. But, YOLO. I actually don't believe that we only live once. I believe that after we die, there is a good chance we'll have some type of experience afterward. I think, I think I believe that when we die, we enter a space similar to that of when you die in a lucid dream. When you die in a lucid dream, it tends to either one, open up a new dream, or two, you end up in a place where it is just all black. There's nothingness. Um, and there's a, there's a term for that in Buddhism. It's like the void. And I'm not exactly sure what it is, but I have an idea. And I have, I have gone there a few times. What I would consider the void of just nothingness. Pure emptiness, yet holds everything. It feels complete, yet yeah, there was nothing there. That may not make sense, but it makes sense when you experience it. I've had similar feelings while taking uh, psychedelics. Psychedelics such as DMT, mushrooms, LSD, all that good stuff. And I had a period of my life where I, I did, um, I would say, a copious amount. An amount that would um, impress other psychedelic adventurers, psychonauts they call them. People who are using psychedelics to explore. There is the same term for lucid dreamers called onironauts. And onironauts are explorers of the lucid world while asleep. And what's interesting is when you're asleep, and you're dreaming you have the same brain chemical reaction and 
uh, wave patterns the same as if you're awake so I feel like your brain does not know the difference nor does your body but when you're in dream your body is locked down you cannot move it's basically paralyzed all right I need to focus a little bit I don't want to get hit by a car that is the last thing I want to do You know, I like I like this mosquito. It's 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 just good. It does its thing and it takes me home and it gets me there. But this um this rough patch is gonna be pretty sketchy. I am not gonna be happy going across and I need to go across fast enough where I don't get hit by by the other green light that's gonna come on. Usually three or four seconds after this. So I have that much time to get past before this people across the street gets a green light. If you guys want to learn more about lucid dreaming, stay tuned because that's probably all I'm going to be talking about for a while. That and scooters. And the crazy things I've done. And the crazy stories. And the ridiculous amount of mistakes I've made in my life. But when you felt like you've lived many lives, it's all good. It is all good. All right, this is brutal. This is brutal. Haha, <laughs> barely.